Good day learners, this is Easy Engineering. This time we're going to talk about determining the molecular mass of a chemical formula. Each element found in periodic table has mass. This is known as atomic mass. When they combine to form a compound, it has mass also. This is known as molecular mass. Molecular mass is simply the sum of atomic mass in a compound. But for ionic compounds, because they are not made up of molecules, the term used is molar mass or formula mass instead of molecular mass. Knowing the mass of the compound is important in stoichiometry. This gives us the hint of how much the compound needed for the reaction or production. To determine the molar mass or molecular mass, let us follow these steps. 1. Identify the element present. 2. Identify each atomic mass. 3. Indicate how much each element. 4. Multiply the atomic mass to its number of elements. 5. Add all masses. For example, what is the mass of tetraphosphorus trisulfide? So write the compound first. That is 4 phosphorus and 3 sulfur. Following the steps in solving for the molecular mass, we have there are only two different kind of elements in the compound. We have phosphorus and sulfur. The atomic mass of phosphorus is equal to 30.97 grams per mole and for sulfur, 32.07 grams per mole. There are 4 atoms of phosphorus and 3 atoms of sulfur. So, for phosphorus, 30.97 grams per mole times 4 is equal to 123.88 grams per mole. And for sulfur, 32.07 grams per mole times 3. So, it's equal to 96.21 grams per mole. Then, add all masses to find the molecular mass. We have... So therefore, the molecular mass is equal to 220.09 grams per mole. Another example. What is the mass of ammonium nitrate? First, write the formula of compound. We have... We notice that there are three different kind of elements. That is nitrogen, hydrogen, and oxygen. The atomic mass of nitrogen is 14.01 grams per mole, for hydrogen 1.008 gram per mole, and for oxygen 16 grams per mole. There are 2 nitrogen for hydrogen and 3 oxygen. So the mass of all nitrogen is 28.02 grams per mole, all hydrogen is 4.032 grams per mole, and all oxygen is 48 grams per mole. Therefore, the molecular mass of ammonium nitrate is 80.05 grams per mole. Just be careful with the counting of elements in a compound. Respect the rules of significant figures and follow the steps for you to get the correct answer. So that's it. That is all for now. I hope you learned something today. Once again, this is Easy Engineering.